And they told me that there is a brother who does hijama. You know what hijama means? Hijama is the cupping. So I said, oh, I'm interested in that if possible. They said he can come here tomorrow. I said, I will go to him. Why should he come to me? Who am I? But then they said, no, 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 he will prefer to come here and he will come at this time. And he came and I did the hijama. And it was not the first time I did it, but it was really, really good. It was more of a dry cupping. There is a difference between the dry cupping and the wet cupping. The dry one, without the suction of blood, but rather it doesn't come out, it's there. And the wet one is when they slice it a little bit and there is blood that comes out. So when I got to the UK, there was another brother who was doing hijama and this time the wet hijama. And I decided I'm going to go for it. And I went for it and it was so beneficial and so good. And you know, there are little cuts which heal very, very quickly, but all the bad blood is sucked out. It's a sunnah of the Prophet Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam. And you feel so good. It helps you, your health, your pain, everything else, you know. People say, how do you manage? I don't manage, but subhanAllah, it's the help of Allah. And I think hijama actually really does help by the will of Allah. So I thought there might be a lot of people who don't know so much about it or who might have heard about it but don't realize how important it is and the fact that it is a sunnah, you get a reward for it.